Hi, everybody. This is Jeffrey and this is Nancy. Hi. <laughs> there was this I Love Lucy. No, no. Yeah, I think it was uh, the Lucy show mm-hmm. where Lucy put on Elizabeth Taylor's ring and it was just her hand. Right. It hysterical. <laughs> it's a great one. You can watch it. That or I can be it. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Okay. Uh, so this is Jeffrey and, Nan- and Nancy Jean's Garden. This is the uh, daily reading for November 19th. We and, do a dual reading. And for those of you who've just tripped down upon us, what we're doing is a universal reading for the day, for the collective, for the energies that are going on around us. I'm going to throw my five stones. Jeffrey's going to throw five cards that relate to the meanings of my five stones. And I'm about to toss the stones so. That was interesting. You gonna go? Uh, sure. Okay. Uh, bo- okay, here we go. Body, you're perfectly balanced. You're being healed. You're perfectly balanced. And if you don't if you don't feel balanced, you know, call on the angels to help you feel calm and, and moderate and balanced and understand that there's magic understand on a really profound level that there's magic running through you through the universe in terms of mind in terms of mind you might be a little bit um unclear as to whether to receive something or not you're you're a little bit unsure but that might get clarified as i go on in terms of spirit it's time for a shake-up it's time for a big shake-up Time for a big shakeup and to plant new seeds out of, uh, out of some, you know, this card is really very interesting. It's actually not as, as dark as most people read it. You know, these little flames really plant seeds of something new. You know, sometimes um, something has to end very uh, drastically and dramatically in order for you to like wake up and say, oh, this isn't working. I need to do something else. And then in terms of grounding, there's a new dawn. There's a new dawn coming. There's definitely a new dawn coming because something is complete, which I think is relates to this. And the interesting thing about this card is that it's very, even though it's very vertical, it's also very horizontal. You know, like the sun is rising after the storm. And in terms of clarity, this is like, uh, for me, frontal cortex. This is about you know using your mind in a really, really uh, clear, um, in, in a very clear vision. And also, that to me, this is Solomon. So this is very much about delegation. You know, very much about delegation. It's like this goes here, that goes there. This works with that. This doesn't work. Very clear. A great organizer. Great manager. So I think it was actually best that you didn't receive this because something better is coming. That's my take. Very, very good. Okay, for me, um, the body today is an incredible place. It's between this, this, this tile in the garden is, is the crown chakra and, it's, and the body is between the two between the crown chakra and future and the way those two lay together on the board is the when the body is in the future it means physical changes are about to appear they're not quite here yet but the crown chakra says light force is guiding your physical change (laughs) we got we, that's my mind is between earth where things are emerging and the path forward and the in the, when mind is in earth when the this particular part of your mind it's sort of all the mental forces you build around yourself it um it's uh final thoughts for all the situations are coming that's what's coming out of earth that's emerging out of earth Hmm. and the path forward says the mind needs to be open and watch for all signs and omens Hmm. so you've got this big change coming you need to be on the lookout for it 
right now, clarity is sitting right in the middle of air and you're, you need to keep your thoughts clear. In other words, this is a place where we can muddy, like the guy under the tree, if I sit there too long contemplating all the aspects, I'm going nowhere. So get your right. thoughts really, really clear. And then the grounding stone is in the throat chakra, which in, means to me truth. And it means boost your self-esteem by expressing yourself. So when I put all this together, today is going to be a day for you to break through and speak for yourself and trust your own thoughts. These stones are telling me your own. This one's sitting on true. Spirit's sitting in true. I mm -hmm. mean, what can I say? It means that when you tie into your own spiritual truth, you can go forward with harmony. Right. with what and whatever and if you have a plan move forward with your plan if you see a new plan because you've had a new vision over here go the new vision mm -hmm. but this is and this is kind of how everybody's going to be feeling and i think it's going to be i think combined with um what's going on yesterday it's moving forward with clarity and feeling good yeah and the clarity really comes through with the emperor right the That's emperor, you know, he makes a decision and he sticks by his decision. He's the manager. He's the one who oversees the whole thing. And, you know, and he's this Aries. Is, he's a warrior. Speaking for your own truth. Mm -hmm. Right. Well, another day done, Jeffrey. Um, uh, please like, subscribe, share, comment, press the bell for notifications. Um, this These readings are going to be available uh, both on Ripe Color and on Nancy Jean's Garden daily. Um, thank you. Blessings. Okay. Bye-bye.